Good morning, my friends. This video is for the first grade math group, and I have you guys working in your workbooks on unit six, pages 38, 39, and 40. So let's take a peek at page 38. Solving a story problem. Solve the problem. Show your work. Max's soccer team has 15 balls. His team let Rose's soccer team borrow six balls. How many balls does Max's team have left? So you need to determine whether this story problem is an addition problem or a subtraction problem. You need to write the equation in your answer and you need to show your work. All right, page 39. More story problems. Solve each problem. Show how you solved it. Number one says, Sam has four big boats and seven little boats. How many boats does he have in all? Remember how sometimes word problems give us a little hint on whether they're addition or subtraction. So be careful and read them carefully because there might be addition and subtraction problems mixed in together. Number two says, Kim had 14 stuffed dogs. She gave four to Rosa. How many stuffed dogs does Kim have now? Number three says, there are five red kites and eight green kites flying in the sky. How many kites are flying in the sky? And then the last one says, the clown was holding 15 balloons. Nine of them popped. Oh, that's so sad. How many balloons are left? So remember, read them carefully because some of them might be addition, some of them might be subtraction, they might all be addition, they might all be subtraction. So just be careful and look for those words that give us a hint on whether or not they're addition or subtraction. And then when you're done with that, page 40 is homework. How many pennies? So pennies equal one. Solve the problems, show your work. Max had 17 pennies. He used five pennies to buy a toy. How many pennies does he have now? So be careful and look for words that help you, okay? And then number two says Rosa had 11 pennies. Sam gave her seven more pennies. Well, that was nice of Sam. How many pennies does Rosa have now? And when you are done with that, you are all good with math for today. So have fun.